Greetings, people of the world. I'm actually feeling quite nervous because I'm about to attempt to get into the back of Barney's Piano Bar, located on Church Street, and I'm currently round the back. I don't know if I can get in, but I've seen a door that looks like a possible entrance. So I reckon I could get, yeah, yeah, it does look like I could get in there. I'm gonna have to not film this bit because it's very awkward. I'm gonna have to climb over this. There's no one about. I better strike while the iron's hot. This ain't gonna be easy. I'm just gonna have to do it. Right, are you ready for this? I'll start filming when I'm on the other side. I can't film and get in at the same time. It's too awkward. Right, you'll see you on the other side. Don't believe it, I did it, I'm in. I can't stay on these steps too long because, as you can see, the flats are over there and by a house. Someone might see me. So the first thing I'm going to do is hide down here. My adrenaline is off the scale right now. Forgive any breath sounds, I'm really out of breath. What have we got here? We've got an emergency control valve. Straight away, it's Half-Life again. This is probably what it's going to be like. Okay, today's date. Monday, the 11th of May, 2020. And it's the day that Boris Johnson announced an easing of lockdown restrictions. But as you can see, I'm in my own version of lockdown. In the meantime, there is a way in here. Get my head torch on. There is a way in here. I think we'll take the opportunity. So I'm gonna have to go in probably feet first by the looks of it. It's a very tight squeeze. Oh God, I hope I don't get stuck. Surprised me when I got trapped in the narrow boat in the cave, remember? Oh God, I can't go in that way. Let's try again. Hang on. Is that a chair sticking out of... it is, it's a chair, look. Will this door open now? I'm going to have to go in head first, damn it. Let's take my bag off first, hang on. There's going to be some messing about here. I'll stop the video a minute. Okay, as you can see, I've put my bag in. So I'll have to lean in head first, it's very dusty. It's a tight squeeze. Oh God. Right, was that a boiler? Oh, I don't even know if I can get in the main bit because it's a sealed off room. Look at that pipe work. There's a door there. That could be a way in. I hope there's no burger alarms or booby traps. This was nearly a booby trap. Check this out. Good God, it's got light work. Be good if the lights worked. Right, now I'm gonna have to mess about climbing over this. I have to climb over this old boiler. Should we get some extra light on? That's better. Let's see what's in here. Valve, handle, oh, look at that vice. Oh, are you kidding me? There's a spade there. That's for hitting zombies over the head with. I hope there's none in here. If there is, we'll have to get my zombie gun out. Oh crap, this is not easy, is it? I'm having to, oh shit. Oh God, I hope this thing doesn't collapse. Right, wait a second, we're in. We're inside the back of Barney's Piano Bar. Look at this vice. It's bolted down. I wouldn't mind that. If I'd have known, I'd have brought some tools to get it, unless I can find a screwdriver. Because, yeah, I can't see this belonging to anyone now. I'll think about, oh, look at these. They're big bolts. They're cool, aren't they? Right, what else is in here? Some old books there, Reader's Digest. Okay. So I don't know what we're in. We're in some kind of pipe room. This will be some kind of boiler engine room. And unfortunately, there is no way into the actual piano bar because we've got a bricked up wall. I am gonna have to go up them stairs. 
in which case I put myself at serious risk of being seen. Is there any other way around it? So, I got covered in dust for nothing. That air vent's collapsed. That's the kind of thing in a computer game, such as the one I keep talking about. You'd open that panel up and you'd crawl through there to get into the other room. Hey, if I had a screwdriver, I'd try that. I'll make an interesting video. I don't know, it looks a bit narrow. Near the bank. Shit. Oh, bloody hell. I'm gonna have to pause the video a minute and get out of here and get on them stairs. See you shortly. I don't know if you can see him or her. There's a black cat on the stairs. That's good luck, I believe. Hello. Hello, black cat. Are you still going to be there when I go up them stairs? I see that as a good omen. Look at its eyes. Okay, I'm going to have to film this and I can't waste any time. I'm going to have to keep low, quiet and stealth. Because I'm going to be in a highly visible area. I'm going to have to go round and up them stairs unless I can climb this. Right, we're going to do this. I'm going to have to use one hand to help myself up. Here we go, right. If I stay low, no one can see. Check me six as I keep going. That's where we need to be there. So I'm going to have to... Oh God, I fell then. Here it is, keep low here. The office block can see me. Come on, it's a quick way this way. Shit. Whoa. We've got this far. I want to get over this fence. You ready? Oh, fuck. Oh, jeez. Right. Ah, oh, God. Whoa. Right, we're in. So we have to get up there. Look at all this wood. Jesus Christ, that wasn't very clever. Right, are you ready? We're gonna go up these, over this step. This way. This is not easy, it's very dangerous. Let's do it. Oh, shit, oh shit. We're in. So far so good, let's not waste time. That's good, having this cover. See Sandown Court in the distance. First checkpoint is get behind or under there because I might not even be able to get in yet. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. Wow. You're kidding me. That was easy. Check this out. This is the upper level of Barney's piano bar. Okay, that was the way in. Obviously, I'm not going to upload this for quite some time. Would you believe it? That clock's still ticking. And is that the right time? No. It's a bit of a smashed up clock. Seven minutes past four or thereabouts. It is about half five probably now. I'm overwhelmed, I must admit. That I got in here. My dad used to come here when he was still alive. Oh, check this out. My life, Bill Clinton. I wonder if that's worth rescuing. I don't know. He's probably going to be talking about Monica Lewinsky. I'll turn this torch off. It's a bit too bright. What's this? Look at all this. The CDs about Bill Clinton and his life. Who'd have thought it? Um, let's put all that together. What is this? Disc, disc two, disc three. There's loads of discs. So he's had quite a life. If you can have five discs made about him, five compact discs, six, six discs. But here's the interesting thing. One's missing. We've got all of them apart from disc one. That's strange. Let's see if it's under this one. No, it's there. We've got a complete set. I'm not sure if to keep that or not. Is it audio or video? It's probably audio. 
He was the president once and he had some kind of fling with Monica Lewinsky, if that was a name. Look at this old filing cabinet and this television. You don't see TVs like this anymore, do you? Well, I'll turn it off because it was on. That's better. What else have we got? I've got something rude on the wall. I'm not going to film it in case children watch because it is a little bit... It's a bit too graphic for kids to see. But I'll give you a rough idea. You've got the top part of her. And then... Yeah. But we won't film any other part of this. Right, let's see what's going on. There's a mirror over here. I'm not going to film the mirror because I don't want to film me. But let's give you a bit of a sneak preview. That's part of me, there's two mirrors.